Hi guys, uh, we'll see what's new in ODA X8, which is Oracle Database Appliance X8 model. One of the database solution. You can see an integrated technology stack over here with applications, middleware, the database, operating system, virtual machine, servers, and storage. Altogether, the applications and database are installed on the same machine within the same stack. This Oracle Database Appliance machine integrates your software, compute, storage, and network resources to deliver the database services with a wide range of customized packaged online transaction processing with in memory database and data warehousing application search which was released in 2011 which is easy to deploy and maintain and to support oracle database environments it's very simple and optimized affordable converged systems as a all-in-one isv solutions it contains both the applications and database you don't need to have separate server for application, separate server for database. One server, it consists of both the application and database. You can see the X8 model family, the different Machines are there in this where Oracle Database Appliance X82S and X82M, X82HA, where 2S for the small single instance with 16 cores with 12.8 terabyte and expandable the RAM up to 384 with minimum 182 GB and three public network cards up to. Whereas medium 32 cores up to and you can expand expandable up to 768 GB RAM with maximum 76.8 terabytes raw storage. Coming back to high availability, you can see 64 cores and it supports rack as well. And up to 92 terabytes SSD storage. With minimum 46 terabyte SSD storage data storage with supports with the latest Intel Xeon processor and increased storage capacity with the power family, physical network ports additional added, and also it supports with 19C database as well. So in terms of performance and in terms of capacity is very higher from X8 model family. We see in the X8 2HA high availability. In this high availability, we can see no the one the option one says that server node one and the call of two it's a server node two and we have a storage shelf in the third column and of optional storage expansion shelf as well. In case you need to have additional storage, we can expand it. This is the one of the typical high availability front panel. You see in the back panel of high availability X8 2, we have server node 1, server node 2 and storage shelf as well as optional storage expansion. With that, in the back panel we can see power supply, SMPS fans. LEDs, ports. So, this is a typical layout of your back panel of your server or to database appliance. Coming back to licensing, which is a simplified investment model. The two options says that 
with the build your own or by database appliance. You need to license all your 72 cores if you build your own. And you need to have from the year 1 up to year 4. But if you go with database appliance, license as you grow. The first year you can have only with 8 cores based on the demand and the growth. In the second year you can see 16 cores went up to. Then after 48 cores in year 3 and 4th year with 72 cores. So we can add on the capacity we had. Whenever you want, we can pay and we can add it. It's a virtualized pricing based on your workload changes. So it's very simple. The investment what we had in database appliance. And it's integrated with cloud. On premises, the database appliance machine where we had, we can migrate your data from on premises to cloud without changing any application. No changes needed in your application, and we can migrate, we can have a backup, we can protect the data. We can archive in the cloud service using. We can have a development and test servers in your cloud from your on premises data database appliance. So you can create a bridge between on premises deployments and Oracle Cloud. We can have backup on their premises to Oracle Cloud as well. We can have the our own backup job scripts as well as we can migrate to Oracle Cloud from on-premises appliance. Even we can unplug the PDB database on database appliance and plug it into Oracle Cloud if you are using multi-tenant and feature. It supports either 12C or 19C. So the Oracle database appliances is integrated with cloud as well. It's a typical layout where from the on-premises to your Oracle Cloud. We can have high availability in your Oracle Cloud with your on-premises ODE mission. Thanks for watching guys. Done with your session.